All right, well, packing for a trip. Let's see what we have here in each of my bags. I do have a little bit of food just in case, even though we're not camping. And we decided not to camp because it's supposed to be 80-90% chance of rain in the Mojave Desert and in Death Valley this weekend. So anyway, we're going to have to hotel it. So anyway, I just have this uh, couple Mountain House meals just in, just in case. Uh, you know, we need them and a little tiny uh, stove here. Um, just to heat up water. Oops. And uh, to look in this bag, I have a heated jacket, which I've had this jacket, this warm and safe jacket, for um, 10 years, I think. I've had to wire a couple different uh, plugs on it when they've sorted out, but um, it's been working for a while. And then let's get in this bag. I have uh, some waters in there. And then in here is a bunch of different types of gloves. I think three pair of gloves. Um, and what do I have in here? So I have a slime um, air compressor kit. Got a few different types of wires and plugs for um, Bluetooth headsets. I have a <clears throat> first aid kit. You want to keep that? I've got some uh, electrical tape. Got an adapter for. Um, yeah, I've got the BMW adapter there to a standard cigarette lighter plug. A little bit of toilet paper. <laughs> Don't leave home without it. Um, I do have this cable just in case you want to lock any of your. All right, uh, what else do I have? I've got a Adventure Moto Touring hat. And uh, you can get these on the website. And I've got a couple different bags in here. And you can see I just have two bags in here. They're just these little small duffels that I've been using for a while that uh, I can put different things in a couple of them. And they fit pretty good uh, inside my saddle. And then if we move on to the tank bag, I've got a, a Wunderlich uh, little bra thing that I really like that hooks to this uh, tank bag. You open it up. Inside, what do I have? Well, I've got stickers in case I need them on the trail and uh, I've got some patches if I run into some adventure riders. And what else is in here? I've got this really cool um, kickstand plate that you can use. It's aluminum to put your kickstand on when it's in the mud. And this was sent to me by uh, Roach on uh, Instagram. It's really cool. What else is in here? I've got this towel to clean your shield. I've got a plug here to plug in and power up this um, three socket outlet. I've got a, a spot receiver. I have a, these are my favorite, I've had for a lot of years, but they're custom molded earplugs. And uh, they're awesome uh, to plug in and use with your Bluetooth headset. Yeah, so what else do I have here? Yeah, just different kind of plugs to uh, recharge uh, Bluetooth headset or phones or whatnot. I have this uh, really cool phone holder that uh, holds uh, any type of phone, which is great. Works well on the road. I've got a first gear heat troller uh, for my heated jacket and gloves. And that's it for the tour. Um, getting the final stuff packed up to head down um, around Lake Powell and uh, Moab, Utah and uh, do some dirt riding on the Burr Trail and the Schaefer Trail and uh, hopefully stay and one thing I forgot to mention, I was able to pick one of these up, uh, this little box recently. It has uh, a lot of tools in it, 
uh, tool roll inside that I keep a lot of my stuff. Anyway, I was able to free up a lot of space, put some tire irons in there, and put a uh, plug kit for uh, tires to uh, plug uh, any type of holes. And uh, it's a slick little setup and frees up some space in my bags. And uh, final look at my machine. Uh, getting ready to go here on this trip. And I uh, usually have a lot more gear packed on the back of it. But uh, like I said, uh, the weather will not permit.